lately, friends, I have been offline. Uh, just recently, I've been posting maybe a few things. Staying offline is good. It, it's, it clears your mind, you know, to, you know, say a few things that you need to been, you've been wanting to say. You know, you've been needing to say. And also, I was finally able to say a few things that I've been wanting to say lately. I've been waiting to talk about some things, and I finally said it. I wrote it down. I put it on Twitter. I put it on YouTube. And the truth is that it is awful what's going on in the world today. If you want to see what I said, it's already been posted. I don't have to tell you because I've already put it up. I put up also a lot of stuff about Hollywood and how awful Hollywood is. You know, about Hollywood, I've already posted a bunch about that too. And also about how awful our government has become now. It's got so bad, our government has you know, also, you know, with Joe Biden being the president and him letting so much stuff get so awful now, you know, we cannot, you know, the things that have got so bad now, the way things are, you know, how can I say this in a nice way without just going you know, saying things that don't need to be blasted out, you know, because people do watch YouTube, and a lot of children do too, so that's why you need to watch what you say on here. Be respectful, everybody. Don't don't say bad things. Be nice and respectful, okay? You know, how can I say this in a very respectful way? Okay, here I go. Um... Every once in a while, it would be good for you, like like I have, I've been doing it lately. Stay offline. Just just stay offline. Because, you know, it's, it, it just, it feels good. Just, to, just stay offline. Because it, it, so many people out here in this world, I tell you, so many people, I'm telling you, and these celebrities, like I have been talking about, you know, they're very, very rude. And they're very awful. And they like to shove in our faces how much money they have and brag about it. I don't care how much money the celebrities make. And also, the way they've been destroying movies and TV shows, it's awful. These children today do not have nothing to watch. We should all be thankful that we had something to watch when we were children. So, every one of you, and I've already talked about that once before, it, it, it's just terrible. It truly really is terrible. Hollywood, they just don't care. They don't, Hollywood just don't give a crap about what is going on. And I'm sorry for my language. I mean... <sighs> But like I said, I really just don't like getting on here that much. It just, what's the point of doing it? Because YouTube's going to pick who they want to be famous on YouTube and who they want to be the big, big, big people on YouTube. They, they pretty much choose who they want to be the big people on YouTube, who they want to be the big famous people and who the big, be the big stars on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? YouTube chooses who they like. We don't choose. They do. They're, you know what I'm saying, everybody. They want you to think you choose. No, you don't. I'm sorry, everybody. You, you, you got it wrong there, okay? And if you think that, you need to double check that because you're wrong. Same thing goes for Instagram as well. Same thing goes for Twitter and Facebook. It, it, I'm telling y'all right now, and also Twitter... 
we already know that Elon Musk is doing as much as he can to help Twitter and fix it. He can only do so much the man can. So, and uh, the thing about it is, right now, with this stuff going on in the world, trying to, you know, uh, I'm telling you right now, I just don't like talking about it. Like I said, with all the problems that are going on right now, how can we trust our government again? And you got one person to blame for all this garbage, and it's Joe Biden and the Democrats. We pretty much, I don't know if we can ever trust them again. After all the stuff they have done, and they have caused so much trouble and so much drama, I'm telling you, I don't know. I really don't know anymore. I, I really just don't know if we ever will be able to trust our government ever again. And also, you're like, what about the Republicans? Well, the Republicans, they try, but the thing about it is, now, how can I say this in a nice way? They let a bill to go, they let a bill go so the Ukraine could have more money from us. So they just let that, sh they, let, they let that go. You know what I'm saying? They let Ukraine have more money again. And I thought they were going to stop that. They promised us they were not going to let that happen again. So see, the Republicans have lied to us again. They keep letting this happen again and again. I am tired of all these lies from the Republicans. They told us they would stop it, but they keep lying to us. Like I said, I don't know if I can trust the government ever again. This is, I'm tired of it. I truly am. And this is just not worth it anymore. Uh, it's just not worth it. And if, like I said, if you want to see what I wrote, it's on YouTube, it's on Instagram, it's on Facebook, and yes, it's on Twitter. It is just awful what has happened, and I, I really just don't see our government ever being the way that it used to be, because really, technically, our government has been pretty bad over the years. They're letting Bill Clinton walk. They've let him walk over. <laughs> He's not even in jail. Hillary Clinton's not in jail. They letting these Democrats just walk. They don't let them go to jail. They let them get away with stuff. They let celebrities get away with stuff. They barely go to jail. I'm telling you. What about these people, all these criminals coming over the border? Huh? What about that? It's awful, friends. It's just awful. And what about these teachers brainwashing your children in schools? Have you forgot that? What about these men? What about these men, like I'm trying to say, that are in women's sports? They're only doing it to get in women's locker rooms. That's just disgusting. These Democrats, they are destroying America, they are. It is just disgusting and awful, I'm telling you. And also, you got these children being brainwashed, like I was trying to say, to they're getting African-American children to hate the white children. It is awful, friends. Oh my goodness, American people. How can we wake up every day and just see this going on? And also, you're like, well, well Mr. Trump said he's going to fix everything. One man. One man cannot fix all this. Okay. Yes, I know Mr. Trump's going to do as much as he can, but one man cannot fix all this, people. Do you think for one second, do you think, do you use your minds, everybody? We have got to work together to, to do something about this. We got to try something. Oh my goodness, it's a pain. It, it just hurts you. It gives you a big, ooh, it hurts your head sometimes. 
Oh my goodness. Thank you for watching.